Hey everyone, just wanted to show you what I made. Uh, I need a filter screen for this uh, filter. Uh, what I did was I took some uh, plastic canvas. You can kind of see it there. And I just took wire ties and, and made a circle. And then I put a pair of pantyhose on there. I think they're called leggings or something like that. But uh, this will allow a lot of water flow. It can get really dirty and uh, still let water go to the filter. You can, you can see my wire ties there on the canvas where I just folded around and made a thing. I didn't, I just put the pantyhose over the top of it. And what I'm going to do is try to put this on and film it. So I don't know how that's going to work. So give me just a second and I'll put that on. Slide that in there, put that on there, and kind of scoot it up to my Java moss wall. You can see I've got a shim behind this filter here. Sorry, but I'm kind of trying to do this one handed. There we go. Okay. I'll move over here where you can kind of see it a little better now. You can see how it goes down in there and it'll keep the... Well, I've got baby uh, rainbow Bosmanis in here now and uh, I'm going to put some cherry, cherry shrimp in here later, so... I'll kind of show you under here. There you go. There's what it'll look like underneath. So, let me plug this back in and see if we can get the pump started. I'll have to prime it a little bit. Sorry. Slide that down. Uh, I've just been keeping this cup on top of here. I don't see none of the baby rain moves now. Of course, I've stirred up the water. But you can see how that that works and it's going to keep the duckweed out of there too and plus the other plants as they grow so, but it works pretty good I've got one on my shrimp tank now thought I'd show you this one and how I made it this is my outdoor planted farm tank that's now turned into being a, a baby tank too so but, uh, that's a real good screen filter. Uh, that uh, filter on there that I've got, it's just a, an old cheap filter, but I've got one just like that on my Emperor 400. And uh, it keeps up with it and it stays clean for a long time. And the way you clean it, you just, you know, take it off and peel the pantyhose off and wash them out and if you tear them up 
put a new set on and I think I've got a box of ten of them for like four or five dollars something like that so hopefully this will keep my babies from going up through the filter and plus when I if I decide to put my cherry shrimp in there I don't want them getting in the filter I might have to move one of my plants to see, but other than that, should be okay. There we go. There it is. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, I just give another shout out to DIY Fish Keepers and everybody that helps me with my DIY ideas. And we'll uh, talk to you later and I'll keep you updated on the farm tank and let you know how the plants turn out. Okay, thanks. Bye.